Uh, New York City Mayor Eric Adams expected to name another new police commissioner next week after reports the current interim boss, Tom Donlin, will be resigning over a federal criminal investigation. Now, Donlin only took that job a few weeks back. He's just one of several in the mayor's administration to be under investigation or heading for an exit altogether. The mayor himself is under a criminal indictment. Morning in America weekend anchor Henna Doba is here with the latest on this uh, ever-changing story. Henna, the country's largest police force is being shaken up for a second time now in, in less than a month. Good morning, Marky. Just last month, yeah. right here on this show, I reported that Tom Donlin had accepted the job as New York City's top cop. Well, just days after becoming the interim police commissioner, federal agents raided his home. Now, Donlin appears to be the latest domino to fall within Adams' inner circle. The former FBI official released a statement after the raid. This is what it said. They took materials that came into my possession approximately 20 years ago and unrelated to my work with the New York City Police Department. End quote. Donlin, you may remember, replaced Edward Caban after he resigned in early September amid the federal investigation. FBI agents also seized Caban's phone and raided his home. Earlier this week, Mohammed Bahi, now he's the mayor's liaison to the Muslim community, he was charged with soliciting illegal straw donations and then lying about it to the FBI. Ba Bahi, by the way, is the first person to be criminally charged other than the mayor in this investigation. And Henna, what's the latest with the other staff members and the latest with the charges against Mayor Adams himself? You're right, it is ever changing. Well, prosecutors have charged the mayor, as you know, on September 24th with bribery and fraud during what they call a, quote, long running scheme and abuse of power. Adams allegedly received bribes, illegal gifts worth over $100,000, campaign cash from foreign interests in exchange for favors here in New York City. Now, he is the first NYC mayor in history to be charged with federal crimes while in office. There are a huge number of Mayor Adams' closest advisors involved. Dolan and Bahi, like I mentioned, they're just two of more than a dozen high-ranking members of Adams' administration who have resigned and or been criminally charged as prosecutors looked into allegations of staff members attempting to cover up wrongdoing. Just to name a few, these are just a few, but they're high-ranking officials. First Deputy Mayor Sheena Wright, Philip Banks, he's the Deputy Mayor for Public Safety. His brother, David Banks, who happens to be the school chancellor, and Timothy Pearson, a mayoral advisor and former high-ranking NYPD official. Now get this, even with all the continuing federal raids, probes, and accusations of wrong wrongdoing, along with many, many calls to step down, Mayor Adams says he will fight the charges and he will prove his innocence, mm. Marky. Now, I'm not a New Yorker, but I know you are, and I imagine uh, New Yorkers everywhere are fed up with all the drama, uh, regardless of what the truth really is. <laughs> Henna really, Doba, every week there's something new. Every week there's point. something new. I know. You and I will be back on air uh, same time next week. We'll, we'll call it a date. <laughs> we will. Henna Thanks for watching, everybody. Go to joinnn.com to find News Nation on your television provider. Also, don't forget to click that red subscribe button below to get more of News Nation's fact-driven, unbiased coverage.